Hello Galaxy Commanders and welcome to this video for Infinite Galaxy. There is some news about the server mergers and I want to go with you through this because this is big big war. I am seeing that they're going to merge the servers just to get rid of 50% of the players playing during that time. But let's see. Before we go there I have a question for you because I am pretty sure I checked it before and never saw it. So who of you knew that we can get the fifth fleet with VIP 14? When did they patch this in? Um, if you know, leave me a comment and let me know. So for those who didn't know, VIP 14 now gives us the fifth fleet. So at a X, <laughs> sorry, at Expedition Q1 and um, that is fleet number five or five you see i don't have it yet i am not vip 14 probably will never get there but yeah for those who are um, spending a lot you might already have it let me know when they edit this because i honestly never saw it before let's take a look at server mergers as we can see here um Camel shared some information about merging servers. Congratulations to every commander who is about to teleport to the nebula from server 32, 35 and 37. Um, I don't know which nebula number that will be at the end, but um, it doesn't matter, more interesting. 90 minutes after the nebula merge is over, they will unlock phase three, rebuild home and then phase four, AGN flying. And um, commanders, please carefully arrange your gaming time so you don't miss out on the best opportunity to attack and occupy. This is this is really big. This is not like um, you miss out on something. If you are not there, you are fucked. Um, sorry for my words, but it is like this. Let's take a look. Rebuild home. After the rebuild home phase is unlocked, all commanders will get the event bonuses. Star platform burning intensified, warship build speed and repair speed. In this phase, all alliances can launch challenges on star platforms. After the star platform is occupied, they can establish the alliance HQ. Okay, so far so good. Um, it's like playing on a new server, just that you all are already high level um, you will get additional warship building speed and repair speed i guess you will need this because this phase will be hot in this phase all alliance buildings will burn faster alliance leaders please arrange the attack and defense uh, properly for the alliance revenue and guarantee the alliance can successfully enter the area it needs to go to in the next phase um, what that means is there will be all the alliances from these three servers in the new nebula and now you have to get access to the AGN because that will be the next phase and you want to get in the middle. Um, I don't know, very likely this will be the new um, star system map like in all the new servers. So keep this in mind, there will not be a lot of system buffs if you go there. Um, very likely I assume that this is also their goal. At the end they will move all of us old players into the new systems by merging us and we will lose all the system buffs that we do have right now. Um, after this phase you go into the AGN flying phase. So they don't say how long the first phase takes. They only say it starts 90 minutes after the nebula merge is over. So now the next phase after the AGN flying phase is unlocked. All alliances can challenge the AGN gate and starfield stage. Alliances that occupy these coordinates can enter the inner ring. Nothing new there. That's the same thing as before. Just that this is now much much more intense because you get the alliances from three nebulas that all want to go into the middle and you have to get your place there so there will be a lot of why i'm i have to see if i can manage to get some video materials of this i'm pretty sure that will be sick when this starts so let's see what we can there so star platform burning intensified warship build speed and repair speed will be closed after this phase is over so you still can burn star platforms 
faster, repair and build faster. But what I'm missing there is um, I don't see that this is anyhow discounted, meaning you will still have the same cost for building and in special for repairing. And repairing is still crazy expensive. We are talking about um, about fights, about space fights, PvP fights. Um, you don't have to attack enemy bases, so you might not get losses there. But if you're going to fight around the AGN gates and you attack enemy fleets, you will have repairs and a lot of these. Okay, so then after the Nebula Catalysm event is over, um, we don't know what the Nebula Catalysm event is. I can only assume that this is um, the merge event, so the combination of all these events. So after this is over, the remaining numbers of times for fast building won't be cleared. So that should mean you do have a certain number to build fast and you still can do this. Please check the detailed rules on the Nebula Catalysm event page. Yeah, um, if anyone can share a screenshot, um, do so and um, let's see what this really looks like. I am very, very curious. When we look into the update discussion, um, Aris from server 6 already shared a screenshot of the new era setting out one. Um, rebuilding your home is surely fine, but yeah, you also do need a lot of materials. So there are some repair speed ups, um, some building speed ups and a few resources. Sure. Um, Camel will also provide you with a perfect um, package for this merge event. Um, yeah, so that is what we know so far about the merge event. I am happy we are not going to be merged at the moment. Honestly, what I think will happen is that a few of the alliances will get into the middle. There will be heavy, heavy fights, heavy losses, heavy repairs, and like 30% of the players in that merge event very likely will stop playing as soon as that event is over. Um, as you can see here, when I click on the last slot accidentally today, I saw unlock this queue at VIP 14. And I said, this was new for me. I never could figure out where we can get the last one. And um, yeah, there it appeared. Okay, so hope you liked the video. Leave me a comment about any idea or any thoughts you have about this merge event. And um, as always, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and then I'll see you all on the next video again.